Hello and welcome to Do You Remember, an ongoing video series where every week I take a look at some kind of article on the internet and then I do my best to remember as much of it as I can and let you know about it. Um, we're going to be talking about Jason McElwin right here. Now, uh, Jason uh, went viral on two different occasions because the internet has a habit of forgetting viral moments so they can just come back because somebody put up a TikTok and now this thing is like, hey, did you see this? But like, yeah, it happened many years ago. But anyway, Jason, or JMac as he is known, um, uh, is autistic and it is Autistic Awareness Month. So I uh, thought I would chat about that. Uh, Jason um, uh, was the manager of his local, uh, you know, his, his high school uh, basketball team. Love basketball was introduced to it by his older brother, Josh. Uh, and he went viral for making just an incredible amount of uh, shots in the final game of the season where he was suited up. He was told ahead of time, I you know, get suited up um, because if we're ahead in the fourth quarter, you'll go out and you'll play. So that is what happened. Well, well, he misses his first two shots. First one, wildly. Second one, not that great. But then he just starts sinking shots over and over again. Of course, this was filmed because it was the last game of the season. Um, and... I love the Wikipedia article because there's no citation about it, but it basically it's just like the filmographer, filmographer was known as a troublemaker uh, because he didn't listen to the coach's instructions and was, cra uh, cr um, sorry, he was uh, panning to crowd shots uh, to get the reactions because it was such a big thing. And I guess apparently the coach at some point was annoyed by that, but I realized this is a good idea. Anyway. This uh, miraculous amount of shots is fantastic. Feel good story, right? Of this thing that they'll talk about that high school for a long time. Well, because it was recorded, a copy was uh, uh, available to a teacher who sent it into the local sports uh, uh, writer uh, on TV, local channel, and that's a feel good story. So we'll put that up there. Gets picked up by other things. Then eventually he's on ESPN and, you know, Sports Center, stuff like that becomes a very big deal again years later it would make the rounds going viral again because somebody edited some of the footage with some text and put it up on tiktok or facebook or something like that and it went viral again but yeah this was a big thing and it's also set a bit of a precedent um where folks that are uh, uh that, that have uh, autism or or other uh, uh issues in, in their life um can be given the opportunity to join the game at the end um of you know last season um, it's not everywhere. It's not a policy, but it's a thing that's been picked up, which is great. Uh, JMac uh, has met, I believe, two different uh, presidents uh, and has been uh, on television, as I said, uh, in interviews. Um, he uh, had a, a short documentary made about him uh, called The Magic of, of JMac in 2009. Um, of course, there's many, many YouTube videos already about this uh, gentleman, but... Uh, it was suggested because it is Autism Awareness Month that I should talk about this story because it's a very good, feel-good story. Um, uh, he is a, a public speaker. Um, uh, he has uh, been a marathon runner, competed several marathons. Uh, um, you know, been been a huge motivation for people uh, from all walks of life, all over the world, which is fantastic. Um, he has had a little bit more time with basketball. Not as much. He is uh, he doesn't get it to play as much, but he is a volunteer coach, uh, assistant coach uh, with the same high school that he attended. Um, and he did have one minor league basketball game. Uh, the local uh, Rochester Razorbacks, a minor league affiliate, you know, affiliate minor league basketball team, signed him to a one day contract at like the last game of one of their seasons. Just like, that's nice. That's a nice little thing. Um so yeah, great story for him. Uh, uh, fantastic, uh, uh, you know, motivation for for a lot of people, and it you know the footage speaks for itself. Go go find that footage out. Look for Jason's footage out there, um, and see because it's just like this is just a high school kid that can shoot and was given the opportunity to do so, uh, and is uh, pretty fantastic. Um, and because not every story. Uh, is all rose because uh, rose tinted because it's you know it's reality. He is a, a citation needed a Trump supporter because we can't have beautiful things without a little bit of some problems here or there. Nobody's perfect, not even J Mac. Uh, so thanks for watching this video. 
Um, uh, I just couldn't let that go. Had to include it. Could have chosen not to include it. Was going to include it. Um, put in the comments down below uh, things you'd like me to check out. You can put links to things or just be like, hey, you should talk about this thing. Uh, find that out. I'll look. I'm, I'm constantly uh, searching for cool, fun articles on Wikipedia or other sources. I keep saying other sources. I haven't done that yet. I will at some point. Um, uh, cause if I was just going to do it about Wikipedia, I would have called it citations needed, but it wouldn't have had uh, a pun with my name on it. Anyway, thanks for watching this. Uh, leave a comment below. Uh, uh, happy autism awareness month. And thanks for watching the video. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.